Hi, my name is Jeremy Ito. I'm a gift officer at Warner Pacific University, and today I am excited to share uh, in a conversation with uh, Philip Ducey, who is in the nursing department here at Warner. Uh, so, Philip, welcome. Thank you for being willing to jump into this conversation. Uh, I'm going to start by asking you uh, why Warner? What, what made you decide to, to jump into the nursing department here? Yeah, so actually, um, my girlfriend just graduated from Warner with her master's. And while she was still in school, um, she had mentioned that Warner was creating a brand new uh, nursing program. So that got me really excited. And actually, I was in the process of applying to um, nursing programs within the Portland area. Okay. And so I, um, I called the school. And actually, I was able to um, meet with our dean, Dr. Linda Campbell. And so when we met, you know, I was just really shocked and, you know, excited. And um, she was so welcoming and and you know genuine and she really just took the time to get to know me and hear my story and I think that really solidified my decision. That's awesome yeah Linda is so great and we are very fortunate to have her and the faculty that are working there uh, in the nursing department. Uh, tell me a little bit as you have jumped into that uh, what has been something that you have appreciated uh, about the nursing department and Warner Pacific uh, as a university? Yeah, so I think something I really appreciate about Warner is the inclusive environment that they create. Um, one of the ways in which I think they do that is through their promotion of diversity. Um, that's something that I really value as well, and that's extremely important. And so, um, you know, I, I just really appreciate how Warner and the nursing program especially um, promotes that as well. Um, you know, during our um, nursing program, we're taught to provide holistic health and human healing. And so, um, you know, being able to see through a multicultural lens and, uh, you know, be a multicultural male in this field, I think it gives me a really unique opportunity to be able to advocate for our, you know, continuously growing population. And, you know, this is just something that's really personal to me and I appreciate how Warner values it so much. Right. Well, and I, I think most people don't necessarily think of uh, being male as, as diverse, and yet in that uh, particular field, uh, obviously, you know, even for myself, I think of uh, a nurse uh, walking into a room and I automatically, stereotypically think she's going to be female, uh, when in reality, you have jumped into a, to that field. Uh, and had a, a different experience. And so I appreciate that perspective uh, and willingness to, to grow uh, and expand all of our uh, understanding in that regard. So uh, tell me a little bit about uh, how you feel like, especially in this time with COVID-19 and uh, concerns and, and the healthcare uh, industry really having a, a larger need. Uh, so tell me how uh, the department and faculty uh, has pivoted to kind of help prepare you uh, for what's going on. Absolutely. Yeah, so unfortunately, um, one of the most difficult transitions for us is not having to be able to participate in our clinical rotations within the hospital. It's hard because, you know, we, we just really value that, you know, in-person hands-on experience. Right. Uh, but, you know, fortunately, our uh, Dean and our um, faculty have provided us with a lot of alternative activities through um, online simulations. And so that's been very helpful. Yeah. Um, as far as, you know, preparing me for a, a career in the nursing field, uh, I guess I just look at this as an opportunity for, you know, the nursing profession to kind of come together and support one and one each other. And um, I guess it's really inspired me to, to um, begin working in the hospital setting and be able to utilize my, my education in order to provide care uh, during this pandemic of ours. That's awesome. Well, thank you again for uh, being willing to answer some of those questions. Uh, one final one. Uh, we have a lot of people who have championed this new department and who have given and supported generously. Uh, what would you want to say uh, to them if you were sitting face to face with them? Yeah, this has just been such a positive and amazing journey within the nursing program. And I just really appreciate all the outside support that we've been provided with. Um, as nursing students, you know, it's really important for us to have 
you know, proper lab equipment, facilities, um, faculty support, all that prepares us to, you know, be ready to enter the field. And so I just want to personally say thank you for all your contributions. And I really look forward to continuing to grow this amazing program. Awesome. Well, thank you again for being willing to, to give up some of your time today and share uh, your thoughts uh, and express your gratitude. Uh, I really appreciate you taking the time. So uh, I know you need to hop off, but thank you again. Awesome. Thank you so much. All right. Have a good day. Thanks. You too.